up close and personal before they hit the big leagues. Well, they need to do something about Harris because uh, that shall be by folks. But to me, it's, it's, it trans if you can shoot it, it translates. That's the best. <laughs> that's probably the best conference in college basketball, yeah, right? It translates. Like if you're going to be one of them in a big conference like that, same with. Uh, Tyler Ennis, if you can produce against big competition like that, I, I think that translates really well. Rick, when you played in your summer league, what was the the main thing you were worried about as a you know a rookie coming into the league? A, a, excessive turnovers. A great player to talk about in that regard is uh, nice pass by Lita. Is is checking in here in a moment for the Suns, Archie Goodman, the guys he's getting traded for, right? Right. Okay. That's all I'm saying is I'm not being aggressive. And, and anytime you want to come to Summer League and, and, and show what you've been working on improving, it, it requires you to actually be brave enough to step out and, and, and attack him. I think he's doing that's a good sign. Yeah, he's he's, he's, he's got it going the, right now. That's the aggressiveness. Nice shot. You want to see from the young player. You know why I'm saying I've been saying Griffin too? Because Griffin took off. And if we got any film from earlier in the week, Griffin took off with a dunk. Oh, yes. I think it was the first highlight I saw. Of I, I, I saw <laughs> former Laker. The most important thing being Phil. Um, the, the interesting part for me is you've taken Chandler Parsons now if you're Dallas and made him your transitional player. Whatever that is going forward. Oh, oh. Lido with the and one on the foul by Warren. His name's Lido. So you were, Lito. I'm sorry, so you were talking about Parsons. I'm thinking of Chandler, uh, Tyson, Tyson Chandler. Chandler. Yeah. So yes, no, this name addition. thing is getting you. Yeah, I'm a little bit off. About two minutes to figure it out. Oh, there's your man there's Aaron Griffin. My guy, Aaron Griffin. Aaron Griffin. If you're a team, you have a LeBron James. You need somebody nice to rebound. Oh! oh. Yeah, Griffin, yes, Griffin's kiss, on a dunk kiss and thank somebody. Him, but his, his brother creates opportunities through his own offense, right? Right, by, right, right. By, by being. But we know what Bledsoe's yeah. capable of doing, and, and we also know that there are certain individuals out there. And when I say the total package, there's professionalism that goes with the equation. Because yeah, you know, some guys, some, within some of those contracts, um, you can say that for most of the guys in this game. <laughs> I do think, Rick, in an era when. Uh, you know, you see a lot of guys early in their career, they it dunk everything, and then yes. five years later, they got no jump shot. Believe they have nothing not, else to work with. It reminds me of Jeremy Evans with Utah. Hey, Ricky, in just 26 minutes, you're 6 for 13 with 15 points. You were on fire tonight. What was working for you? Um, it was just my teammates getting in the groove. I found my, my teammates with the pass early, and they and it opened up a lot for me. So that, that's most of it. That's most of it. You played in 11 games for the Mavs last season. You're trying to prove, look out, that you can play more. What What is that going to take? Uh, just continue doing what I'm doing. Uh, showing I can pass the ball, make plays for others, and also score and continue working on defensive end. All right, good luck. Thanks for the time. Thank you very much. Guys.